best part of the interview is finding out your story. And so, Linda, I want to start with you tonight and tell us your story of how you came to know the Lord. Well, mine is kind of a long story. When I was uh, in high school, uh, I was not raised in a Christian home. I went to uh, church with friends. And um, it was kind of a thing where they, everybody expected me to come forward and get saved. They wanted me to, and they were on me constantly. You, you need to get saved. You need to get saved. So uh, one day I just went forward just so I didn't have to listen to them anymore. And, but there was no change in my life. And it wasn't until I married Bob that we were, I was finally knew what a Christian home was. I wasn't, I mean, my mom was great. She was a single mom, but um, I didn't know Christ. I didn't know anything about him. And um, we got involved in church and I got saved the same day Bob did, uh, went forward and don't remember who I prayed with. I don't remember what I prayed. All I know is it, there was a change of life. Um, I went, uh, we went and we were baptized together and, um, and it still makes me teary eyed. I'm sorry. Um, but I remember coming up out of the water and saying, thank you, Jesus, Amen. because I was so refreshed and renewed and such a, it was such a special time for me. And I, it's a, something I'll always cherish. Amen. Well, Linda's basically told the story. We were involved in the church and uh, I was kind of raised in a, in a church from the age of about six. And uh, I was uh, leading a small Bible study for fifth grade boys. And uh, they had talked to me about perhaps becoming a, a deacon. And uh, one Sunday I was sitting there, and, and our church members know this because I tell this story all the time, um, just because you go to church doesn't mean you're saved. Right. And I was standing in the back of the choir, singing in the choir, and the Holy Spirit really worked me over and, and told me that I wasn't saved. And I came forward that morning, and uh, like Linda, I don't know who I prayed with, but I do remember getting up and just feeling tremendously relieved because in the audience was my mom and dad. And I've been living this life of being a Christian, so to speak, but yet I was not a Christian. I didn't know how they were going to react to that. And I didn't know how the audience was going to react to that. But I will say that that decision was the very best decision that Lynn and I have ever made. And the church readily accepted us. And my parents were so happy that it was kind of scary because I didn't know how they would respond. But it was a wonderful experience. And then when we were got the opportunity to be baptized together, that was really a, a wonderful time. And life has just increased from there. One thing that I do need to add is because of that conversion and that life, my mama got saved. Yeah. Amen. 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 Amen.